And I would just say that's a great ending to that. Yeah. That I, I think in some of these, I don't always know why, but I do know how God asked me to respond to the hurting. Mm-hmm. And so don't let the big question distract you from the practical element of what needs to be done. I don't know why this happened, but I do know what my response is supposed to be. Um, and so I think that maybe then brings it back down to even on the broader theme of, I think that's where I want to live too. I want to be mindful because I'm a disciple of Jesus and I want to bring every thought to conformity and I want to live a life of integrity where all the pieces do fit together in a real way. I want to be mindful of what's going on. And are there big questions? Are there things that are unknown? Absolutely. And some of those are actually really fun yeah. to sit on the cusp of the unknown and see that the, the extents of the mystery that is yet to be discovered and known um, is a beautiful position to be in, recognizing that there will be brokenness, that I'm called to step into that and to help as I can and as God equips me, but to also recognize that there's real hope for the future, that there is a real restoration, and that that posture of hope gives me a real peace in this moment that should allow me as a Christian to be clear-minded and level-headed and be in step with the Spirit of God as he has uh, what he has for each of us to do in the upcoming days. Yeah.